Hi, it's Cole here with Cape Fear Customs. To continue with our educational series, we're going to talk alignment. And alignment is basically measuring and adjusting several suspension and steering angles that affect how your vehicle handles. Today, I'm going to quickly go over what an alignment measures and these important angles that you need to know about when modifying your vehicle. Three angles that are important to know are camber, caster, and toe. First off, camber. Camber is the measurement of the tire's center line relative to the road surface. Camber can have a major part in the dynamics of how your vehicle handles. Negative camber is when the top of your tire tucks in towards the body. Positive camber is when the base of your tire tucks inward towards the body. Positive camber and the steering axis inclination can reduce both tire wear and steering effort. The steering axis inclination is the angle between the center line of the steering axis and the vertical line from the contact surface. The distance between these two is called the scrub radius. Positive camber results in a smaller scrub radius, meaning less steering effort and tire wear. Most street-driven automobiles use a small negative camber. The camber is further negated for performance vehicles to improve cornering. When you turn, your vehicle rolls. Doing so puts much more weight on the outer tire. With the negative camber, it makes sure this extra weight is evenly distributed on the road. The downside to negative camber is that there's slightly less grip during straight line driving. Caster. Caster is the angle of the steering axis from the vertical axis of the wheel. Positive caster is when the wheel is in front of the upper pivot point. Negative caster, you guessed it, does the opposite. Toe. Toe is the direction the tires are pointed in relation to the center line of the vehicle when viewed from above. Toe in means your tires are pointed inward towards the body. Toe out is the opposite. The toe angle helps your tires run parallel to each other. Rear-wheel drive vehicles typically apply a toe-in angle. Rear-wheel drive vehicles push the front tires. This causes the tires to push back, so a toe-in angle corrects this suspension issue. A front-wheel drive vehicle is pulled by the front tires. The body of the vehicle then resists moving forward, pulling the wheels in. The toe-out angle helps to fix this. The toe angle helps to improve steering response. Toe-in reduces oversteering, toe-out reduces understeer. Excessive angles in your suspension can cause uneven tire wear and added stress to your suspension components. This will ultimately cause safety issues and expensive component replacement. Make sure all components are installed and functioning correctly and get yourself in alignment. If you have any questions, ask us below, shoot us an email, and tune in for more builds and educational videos. We'll see you soon.